Hi, I'm Jason and I'm here with Dan Ruder from Upol. Today's video will be the fourth of a five-part series which covers the versatility of Upol's Raptor protective coating system. Thanks for having me here today, Jason. Raptor is a tough and tenable, highly UV resistant protective coating that protects surfaces with a protective barrier that can withstand the toughest situations. Raptor is extremely versatile and is ideal for multiple applications and industries, including automotive, marine, commercial, and industrial. Raptor can be sprayed on various surfaces, including metal, wood, concrete, plastic, and plaster. Amazing. Dan, what will you be demonstrating today? Today I'd like to demonstrate how to perform a wheel restoration. We get quite a bit of questions about it, so it'll be great to demonstrate how to prep and coat wheel rims. All right, let's get to the spray booth. All right, let's do it. As you can see, we've removed the tire from the rim. We've already washed it to remove any road dirt. So the first thing I'm going to do is remove any wheel weights that are still attached to the wheel. Then I'll use 180 grit sandpaper to sand all the contoured areas of the wheel to ensure mechanical adhesion. Next, I'm going to take my air hose and blow off the rim to remove any remaining dirt or dust. Then I'll degrease the entire wheel using our wipe six. Next, I'll tape the valve stem to avoid getting any Raptor on it. It's good to note that if you're doing this with the tire still attached to the rim, you're going to need to tape off the entire tire. Next, I'm going to apply our UP5023 Acid Etch Primer, or you can use our UP4842 2K Epoxy Primer to cover the surface area, particularly any bare metal spots and contour areas. Make sure you apply two coats. In this application, I'll use a quart of UP4801 2K Raptor Black and apply with our UP4880 Vary Nozzle Gun. For those using the disposable paint cups, you can follow the 3 to 1 mix ratio to avoid activating a whole bottle. After activating the product, apply the first coat of Raptor with 55 PSI inlet pressure and from approximately 24 inches from the wheel. Wait about 60 minutes before applying the second coat. Finally. Spray the second coat of Raptor at a 45 degree angle opposite from the first coat to ensure uniform coverage. You should allow 24 hours to dry before attaching the wheel to the vehicle. Dan, thanks again for a great demonstration. Where can people go to learn more about Raptor products? Well, Jason, thanks for having me today. For more information, visit raptorcoatings.com. Great, Dan, thanks. I'm Jason Stahl. Thanks for watching.